I want to take a moment to begin this video and talk about this struggle we're having with this channel. It's really kind of the way that gun channels are interacting with Google and YouTube is affecting us and it's affecting our ability to be able to produce content. So I want to take a moment and just ask you to support us on Patreon where a lot of the content we can't put here is going and it supports this ministry. It seems like the majority of the population of Americans are already familiar with the concept of firearms mm -hmm. and non-military and citizens, just regular average citizens owning firearms. So this is how we've been raised. This is the country and the way we have been raised in. And we know that this is a right, a, a second amendment right for every American citizen. However, there are other countries that do not have the freedoms and the rights that we so often take for granted here in the United States. That being said, the internet has now pushed our pushed everyone to a broader audience, a global audience. It's not just local. It's not just in your community or in your city or even in your state. This is international now. Mm -hmm. I mean, once you post something online, everybody that has access oh, yeah. to the internet can see it including people from other countries that sure. may not have the same beliefs or freedoms that we have here. So I kind so, you know, of wonder. Because I, I have like a, I have to, I'll, every now and then I'll look because on YouTube you can look like where are people watching from. Yeah. Yeah, it's fascinating. It's mostly America. But, you know, strangely, a lot of people watch gun content from Thailand. Yeah. High level, like you, like there's a lot of people watching God Family Guns from time to time for some <laughs> reason. Um, as well as Iraq is another one that was always really high, which is really strange. Is this places that we have? Because I can look at how many views I got in each country. Is is this like military? Like I don't know, um, but it like just shows deployed how military with internet access, or is this uh, uh, like call center like? pay to monetize kind of like i <laughs> well, mean like there was one time and this was really cool is, or, there, is in the way, very beginning there was a guy who messaged me and he was from he watched and he was from a little island in indonesia and he was the only christian on the island and he was asking me to pray for him because he was under heavy persecution from everybody on the island um and is putting his family in danger and all that. And I just thought that's kind of just, it's a, such a strange thought, um, but it really opens your eyes to the global aspect that you're talking the, about. Yeah. We have a small, short, direct route that we travel every day, every week, every month, every year, however many mm. miles you put on your vehicle. There are more miles than that across the globe. <laughs> and there right, are more right. people that you have never come into contact with that maybe they don't speak the same language as you. Maybe they do, but maybe they do or don't appreciate the same things as you too. So sure, sure. human condition just, Good stuff. yeah, it's everywhere. Good stuff. <laughs> right. I, that's, that's really curious though. Like all the people from places across the globe it's really interesting that time we got letters at Blue Steel from the gentleman that lived in Spain, I believe. Do you remember that? Yes. A few yeah, years yeah, ago. Yeah, I do remember that. Uh, yeah. I still have my letter. I, I thought that I was the coolest too, yeah. thing. I received, <laughs> we received mail from Spain. I know, somebody typed something up. And... Uh, maybe it was, maybe it was like Portugal. I'm, oh, gosh darn, I'm so bad. I can't remember. I think it was Spain. I, 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 I really want to say it was Spain, but I'm yeah. so sorry if I have. I, I will go back and I will reread that letter and I will know for sure. Yeah. Um, but yeah, that that's cool that, that there is a international audience. But at the same time, I think I wonder if that is why certain platforms 
demonetize or censor mm -hmm. is because it is not allowed in the other pl in the other parts of the country. Well, there are certain countries like if um, I don't know which ones they are offhand, but I know if that was the case, you just wouldn't get paid for anybody watching it in that country. In that if country, that makes sense. Like yeah. if you were in that country and you clicked on an ad, I wouldn't get anything. Yeah. yeah. And YouTube still That's gets right. so, you YouTube know, always the, gets paid. Yeah. Of course they get paid. The, yeah, yeah. the platform always <laughs> gets paid. Always gets paid. The content providers mm -hmm. don't always get paid. That's the unfortunate yeah. part. So that's right. pretty interesting, though, the yeah. global audience and how things it's work. fascinating. Well, yeah. yeah, just guns are going global. <laughs> always have, always will. So, That's true. I mean. And thank you so much for taking the time to oh, stop. Of course, yeah. This is yeah. amazing. It's always good to be here. That you put oh. this information out there for so many people. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Well, thank you for getting it out there, too. We appreciate <laughs> you. <laughs> hey, I don't quite have the reach that you have. <laughs> You, you, yeah, you do. <laughs> you have the same reach I have, actually. <laughs> it, but you know, he needs all the credit. Like, oh, seriously, no. this he's the one no. that does all the hard work and heavy lifting. So, yeah. Uh, well, Maggie, thank you. Thank we really you. appreciate you. Thanks for taking care of yourself. Oh, yeah. Thank yeah. you for taking care of all of your patrons yes. and your viewers. And thank you also... For all the tiny local gun stores that you have stopped at on the road, <laughs> in your travels yes. across the U.S., <laughs> not just do. this one, but every oh, single yeah. other one, I can tell you, you make people's day. Oh. Not just you, but everybody that stops at the local shops on their way, you make people's days and your dreams come true. Thank yeah, you. Yes, I mean, there was a local, uh, it was down towards the Ozarks, but I popped in. I just stopped in. Just popped in. <laughs> And this guy goes, I was always wondering if you'd ever stop in. <laughs> I was like, yeah. And I kind of was looking around. And, and all of a sudden, like, five of his relatives showed up. You know? <laughs> uh, he probably texted me. You'll never guess here. Yes, he was, was in the yeah, store. It was, it was really kind of awesome. I actually bought a gun from him, too. Yeah. I That's did. freaking sweet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's so cool. I've, uh, I've gotten phone calls out of state for shops that you've stopped. You'll never, I'm sending a gun to you. You will never guess who this is for. We had a YouTuber in here. I don't know if you know this guy, but he's got a channel called God Family and Guns <laughs> and he bought one of our guns. And That's I was just funny. like, I was like, I am so, I was like, how was your experience? <laughs> you know, and they were like, <laughs> it was great. He's such a great customer and he came in and he's so cool to talk to. Aww. I'm like, well, yeah, but, you know, that, that's all the cool <laughs> customers. That's yeah, just not the yeah. ones that have the YouTube channels, oh, too. There's, all, there's a lot of cool customers. That's but to hear. you do. You cheer people oh, up no okay. matter where you go. That's good. Congratulations. Well, thanks for that information. You do, too. Uh, yeah, but I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, Maggie, thank you so much. You are so welcome, and we will see you the next time you stop packing gunners. All right, we'll see you next time. All right. Bye, Mark. Bye, -bye. Bye everybody. <laughs>